Hello. My name is Joe. Um, uh, it's about 5.30 in the morning right now. And uh, it's already daytime. Uh, well, let me explain to you something. I am not a miner. I am not a um, prospector. I mean, I don't know nothing about how to pan for gold uh, manually, but what I do know is that I'm an inventor. I make things better. I'm a scientist in what I do. I'm going to show you the products that I have, and I'm opening up my own store called Goldzilla. The Goldzilla product. I think you guys would like it. Here, check it out. Um, you can see this little box. See, this is my gold mining pan. Uh, it's not it's not the greatest pan in the world because you know these ridges. This is a cheap pan. It's only five dollar pan. This little box right there that I place on there. Um, it's one incredible box, I'll tell you that. It's something that I have created and patented down. And whoever copies this patent, I guarantee you I will soon. But, okay, let's get down to this box. This box, as you can see, is called a Godzilla Pan Handler. I call it the pan handler. What it is, it has a low frequency sonic vibration that you glue right on underneath your pan or underneath the bowl, the bowl of your, um, your, uh, what's that, hand dredge. That's what they call it, hand dredge. And the way it works, is that the sonic vibration itself will send anything heavy and liquefy it straight down to the bottom of the ball. Here, let me show you what type of what type of mess it does. This is this is just plain cornmeal. All right, I'm gonna show you what it does. Uh, it's a bit hard to hold this. Yeah. Let me hold this on like this. And, well, let me explain something too. It runs off four AA batteries. You can get rechargeable batteries too. It's up to you. Um, this battery has a little switch on there to turn it on and off. I'm going to show you what it does though. Pretty incredible. I mean, if you guys are pretty scientifically inclined, you would know the vibrations of a low frequency range would actually make anything that's heavier than sand itself sink straight down to the bottom. There it is. As you can see, look how it moves. How it spreads out. Okay, let me, let me try this again. There you go. Sorry. Sorry about the shaking of the camera and all that. It's hard to hold it down while I'm doing this crap, but. Hey man, I am not shitting you about this because tell the truth, this is this is deep freaking scientist bullshit. And this is real deal. Everybody knows it. Why do you think these panners they shake the pan? They shake it because they want the gold to sink down to the bottom. So this is a way that you can do it without having to 
shake your pan down. You don't have to be a professional to do this yet. But the fact is, hey, you know, you want to get gold, you want to make money, this is the way to do it. But there's my switch right there. Let me turn it on. Now look. Look at how it moves. So the way it moves, it liquefies every sediment of sand and everything heavy will sink down to the bottom. See? Okay, let me try to get this on one spot and it doesn't want to go. Remember what they say about tapping, tapping the pan and all that? To make the gold crawl up, you don't need to tap it no more because the gold will crawl out of the black sand. It is a pretty amazing invention I have. I have several more. Here, let me dump this out. Let me show you some water. Tell me what water will do with it. Okay. Now you're going to see the vibration of the water. Okay, I hope you can see it towards the light. Or the vibration. Let me see if I can get it right. The sonic vibrations. I wish you could see it. I'm not sure if you could, but. I'm using a cheap Walmart camera because my camera got sunk in the water and uh yeah, I just got a waterproof camera really. Yeah. Maybe if I rise it up a bit. See the vibration? Yeah, I'm sure you can see the vibration now pretty amazing. So, yeah, well, my website's going to open up real soon. It's called goldzilla.com. Let's see how much your vibration is on this there. That's a vibration. There, watch it move. Low frequency vibration. See, I run it with a line long enough so you can put the batteries in your pocket so it doesn't get wet. And, uh, yeah, why top the pan or why shake it anymore? You just leave it on there, have it vibrate itself down to the, down to the bottom of the pan and just wash off all the other crap that you don't need. It makes painting a lot faster, a lot easier. Get the gold, get the job done, get rich. Alright man, I hope you guys like this video. The next video I'm going to have is uh, based on my new hand dredge, Sniper. Oh uh, man, you can't wait to see that one. That's going to be pretty pretty sick. Man, what's the use of a sniper? All these are um, patent down and um, I have all documents of it so don't worry. The only way you get it is through me. Just send me um, or give me a comment through YouTube and um, I will send out my email so if you guys want to make an order, you know, let me know. Um, yeah, I'm still figuring out how much I'm going to sell this product because I've done a lo lot of work just to get this thing going. So, I mean, I'm deciding about like in the range of like $35 or $30, around that range. But Probably about thirty dollars. Thirty dollars would do. Yeah, I think that's how much I would sell this for. But 
What's thirty dollars for you miners, man? You guys, this thing would really pull out a lot of gold. Here, let me show you. There's the box. You just get some glue, glue it right on your pan. Pretty lightweight, not heavy. Couldn't even notice it's there. Wouldn't even notice it there. Very light. I'm just doing this in my kitchen right now, but yeah, I'm gonna be going to the either the Yuba River or Bear River or the North Fork of of um, the American River and do a little video there and show you how this thing really kicks ass. I tell you, do your math. I mean the vibrations and the weight of the gold itself will sink to the bottom of your pan. Even the fine gold. And you don't have to struggle hard, so hard and burn, burn so much minutes that you wasted just panning just to keep the gold on the bottom of your pan. Why do you think people shake the pan so much? I think that's just a waste of energy for me. So, you know, like I say, I'm an inventor. No, I'm not a... I'm not a pan handler. That's why I call this a pan handler. Alright? So, I'll be opening up my website soon. I'm going to open it up as goldzilla.com. Yep, this is Goldzilla signing off. Alright, good mining, guys.